Welcome to Sunday, June 5th, 2022. This is the Firebrand Daily Devotional from the office of our senior pastor, Dr. Pastor Halidu Abraham of the Revival House Church, where our headquarters is, is in Lokoja, Nigeria, Kogi State. God bless you. Today is, uh, like I said, Sunday, June 5th, 2022, and we are looking at the soul winner's reward. The soul winner's reward. Hallelujah. The Bible speaking in the book of Proverbs chapter 11 verse 30 says, The fruit of the righteous is a tree of life, and he who wins souls is wise. The fruit of the righteous is a tree of life, he who wins soul is wise. We have heard severally on television and on radio how the Nigerian police promises to reward people who will give information necessary for the arrest of wanted criminals. The purpose is to bring the criminals to justice. No doubt our law enforcement agents know that the hope of a huge reward is the only motive that will have power to make people with useful information come forward to give them. It is good to note that there is a reward for helping to bring men to justice. Hallelujah. But there is a far better reward in helping to bring men to mercy in Christ. This reward is of a higher order than the reward for bringing men to justice. But there is uh, the law enforcement agents who are all hunt down criminals, but we believers in Christ will rescue the perishing souls of men. Criminals hide from law enforcement personnel, but sinners who need to be sought and saved are all around us every day and they are around us everywhere and in every place. Hallelujah. Soul winning is a service which brings great benefits to the individuals who concentrate, consecrate themselves to it. If they give themselves to it, divine beautification. Most people do not go out for evangelism or for soul winning because of shyness or some minor limitations. But the simple truth is that whenever you go out for soul winning with understanding, you will be beautified by God, just as the Bible recorded. And is the Bible says, And they that be wise shall shine as the brightness of the firmament, and they that turn many to righteousness shall be as the stars in heaven forever. That is Daniel chapter 12, verse 3. Meditation point this morning. Before I tell us the meditation point, I just want to let us know, you want to be beautified by the Holy Ghost. Do you want the Spirit of God to beautify you? Then get yourself involved in aggressive soul winning. Bring men to righteousness. As you do so, Yahweh will multiply and Yahweh will beautify your destiny in the name of Jesus. What's our meditation point today? Proverbs chapter 11 verse 30 says, The fruit of the righteous is a tree of life, and he who wins souls is wise. That is the meditation point. Now we are going to pray, lift up our voice this morning. We are going to ask that God will give us a passion for soul winning. It takes passion to go after souls. Open your mouth and say, Father, in the name of Jesus, I ask that you will give me passion for soul winning. Make me a soul winner, O oh God, in the mighty name of Jesus. I want to be the hand you will use. I want to be the mouth you will use. I want to be that heart you will use to go after souls in the name of Jesus. Father, thank you, Lord. I receive that passion. I receive grace to be passionate about soul winning in Jesus' name mighty name. And as we win souls this week, Jehovah will beautify our lives in Jesus' name. God bless you. We'll meet again tomorrow. Give us your testimony. What were your experiences when you went out for soul winning in the comment section? We shall be meeting again tomorrow, the same time, the same place for the Firebrand Daily Devotional. Until then, keep shining like the stars in the firmament because you are a soul winner. God bless you in Jesus' name. Amen.